Okay, so here we are again, and I wanna talk about a concept called true massive action. And what is true massive action? The reason I wanted to explain this concept is because if there's any concept out of all the concepts that you hear about here, I promise this will change your life the quickest out of anything that I've discussed so far or any of the instructors discussed so far. And that's true massive action. So to illustrate this, I wanna tell you a story. A while back, I was helping a friend do a presentation for this pitch comp competition that we're in. If you watch my stuff before, you may have heard this. But there was a pitch competition where one person could come up at the end of the entire event right before they announced the winner and they could pitch their business to everybody in the crowd. Now this place is packed. It's, just, it's just full of like 300 people. It's just an amazing event. And I didn't even have a business card at the time. So what I do is I go take a friend of mine's business card and I put it into the bucket. Now, to be honest with you, I didn't think anybody was gonna call that. So I really didn't take it that serious, but I went to the restroom. And when I was coming back, I remember my good friend, Will, he was sitting there, Will Power, the world's most hated promoter. And he said, they're gonna call the card, they're gonna call the card. So, you know, in my mind, I'm still thinking, you know, you put a random card in a bucket, nothing's gonna happen. But to my surprise, they actually did call the card. So I go up on stage and I get up there and it unfolds like a movie. They, get, they let this uh, old lady go first, and this other young girl goes after me. And then finally, it's my turn. Now, I could have got up there and I could have said, oh, well, you know, I'm just gonna say something simple. But I said, no, I'm about to be bold. I'm about to take a bunch of action. So I get up there and I'm like, I got a confession to make everybody. My name's not actually Abe Rios. The whole crowd goes, oh, as if I had just done something so shocking. And I turned to Damon John, because another thing, Damon John from the Shark Tank, he was on this panel. And I turned to him and I say, I took a page out of your playbook and I decided I need to take action. Now, before this, nobody was even paying attention, but the entire panel stands up. And as I'm giving my speech, I can see Damon John looking over me. And then he points to me and says, hey, I want to meet you. Now, I tell this story, and just to give you the end of the story, I actually got kicked off stage because they thought that I wasn't the actual person who put the card in there, but that's another time for another story. But the point of this was that just that quick, just in that millisecond, I was able to change circumstances by possibly meeting Damon John and forming a business connection. Now, maybe it wouldn't have been that, but the point I'm saying is that action, that massive action, is what allowed me to move forward. Now, I'll be honest with you, that was a cornerstone in a lot of the content that I created to build up my business to the point it is now, simply because I took action. Something that was bold that people didn't wanna do. So what am I explaining to you in this video right here? What I'm saying to you is basically this. There's a lot of scary shit that you can do. But a lot of times we just don't do it because we don't wanna take massive action. The first time I knew I needed to do YouTube for my business, I was scared out of my mind. I was scared shitless. But what I did do was I just went out there and start taking action. So let's say here at the Entrepreneur Trap House, if you've been watching any of our content, one thing that we needed to do one time was get more clients. So did we sit back and say, well, you know, let's just put out a couple ads and hope clients come to us? No. We actually went straight to the people. We would get on phones and cold call people. We had this one thing where we actually cold call just to practice. We cold call pizza restaurants just to see if we get a free pizza, just so we could experience rejection. Here's Justin trying to negotiate a free piece. So I'm calling you and I literally have a million people that are about to see this video. The purpose of this video content is to see if there's a way you and I can come to an agreement that you would deliver me a pizza for free so that a million people would see that you would give it to me for free because you're a good person. Uh, to be honest, I can't do that. I'm sorry. But you know what resulted in, at the end of that? We actually got a free pizza. A free pizza? We have to get some serious, we have to like face some serious rejections if we're gonna have balls of steel on Monday. We need to get into that feeling where it feels comfortable to get rejected. Hey, how's it going? I'm glad I got you here. Now, I wanna ask you a quick question. Um, I'm actually sitting here doing a video content for YouTube and we've got a million people live streaming right now. And I wanna see what would it take for you to get a free pizza delivery to me right now so everybody can see it. They're gonna recognize your Papa John's location as the one who did it, as, as something good for people. Come on, man, come on, man. Come on, man, like, c come on. I don't know, man. Uh... Look, you're gonna be the person who, you're gonna put this out to a lot of people, man. I want to do this. That's why I called you so excited right now. They're literally, they're typing on the side of the screen right now. They're saying, hey, come on, get it. You can get it, you can get it. Man, I hate to be the one. I don't have no drivers, man. Oh, come on. I'll I, I literally, cause we can live stream from the car. Can you hold it for me? We'll come get it. Do I'll live stream from the car. We got the phone running right now. I'll live stream all the way to you. Can you hold it for me? Yeah, I'm holding it. 
Okay, okay, perfect. So basically they said we had a challenge to see if we could close a person for a free pizza on the phone. And uh, we actually closed somebody. Shit. Oh, oh, God. God. oh my gosh. Thank you so much. So this is what we call success pizza. Mm. That's what success mm. and success and mm. success looks like. And the same thing when it came to getting clients. The thing I'm telling you is, no matter what you're doing right now, you have to really take to heart that you have to take massive action in order to be successful. Massive action is not working just a long time, but it's actually doing the scary stuff that you need to do, the things that are outside your comfort zone that push you forward. When I first started off, I would literally do stuff like pick up phone books and just call, 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 call till I set up a meeting. But now that I have these skills, I'm able to take that massive action and focus it to something more productive that's more efficient in getting me the success I want. So in a course like this, this is what we're doing. We're focusing your skill set to get you to the place you want. But how fast and how quickly you apply this stuff is gonna determine how quickly you'll be successful. And massive action is the one thing that I always talk about. That's why I have the massive action movement. That's why I believe in it so much. So what does massive action look like? Massive action is basically, right now, write down say 10 things that you wanna do over the next 30 days. 10 things that you wanna accomplish in the next 30 days. And no matter what, no matter how scary, no matter how time consuming, no matter what you have to put yourself through in order to get those 10 things, and nothing crazy, because I don't want you saying that I told you to do some, some silly shit, but 10 business objectives that you want to accomplish that can be accomplished, whether it's getting started, which we're going to show you how to do in this, uh, getting your marketing together, which we're going to show you how to do in this, learn how to network with people, which we're going to show you how to do in this, all these things, I want you to write them down. So let's say if you need to meet 10, 20 new people, Go out there and meet those 10 and 20 new people. Because I tell you, this type of action is the thing that's gonna really push you forward. And it's not talked about a lot. Because if you don't do the scary stuff, it doesn't matter how much we teach you in this course, you're still gonna be inside your comfort zone and everything that you want to be successful is outside your comfort zone. And the reason I add this mindset stuff is because, once again, if you don't have the right mindset, you remember I talked about mindset plus skill set equals what? Success. So massive action is definitely a mindset that you need to have and that's all I got to say about that. Enjoy.